I don't know. I'm not I'm sure. I'm a believer. I'm a believer. I don't know if I can pick him I'm up. I'm a believer. Wait a minute. I'm a believer. That's him. It's Justin I'm Bieber. Welcome to Lawyer Flash, I'm your host John Deere and I explain the law. This week, pop artist Justin Bieber is in legal trouble coast to coast. First of all, in Calabasas, California, he's being investigated for felony egging of his neighbor. On the opposite coast in Miami, he was arrested for drag racing, DUI, and resisting arrest without violence. This week, we're going to imagine Mr. Bieber's been convicted for all of these crimes and look at how long he could stay in jail. First up, DUI in the Sunshine State. In Florida, a minor can be convicted of driving while intoxicated with as low as 0.02 blood alcohol level. That's one quarter the amount required to convict an adult. Justin Bieber is still a minor. That's up to six months jail time. Still in Florida, there's the charge of drag racing. That normally means racing side by side with another car, but the statute does allow conviction with only one vehicle. Again, that's up to six months in jail. And finally, to fill out the Florida crimes, there is resisting arrest without violence. According to one public report, Mr. Bieber's alleged to have been belligerent to the police officer when he first pulled him over. In Florida, that's a crime. Possible sentence, up to an additional six months. Moving on to the lovely little community of Calabasas, California. Justin Bieber has a history of getting into it with his neighbor. Six months ago, Sheriff's Department recommended that he be charged for spitting on his neighbor. Not guilty! Had he been charged, the charge would have been assault. In California, an assault is an unlawful attempt with a present ability to commit violence on the person of another. Possible sentence for assault, up to another six months. Then last week they got into it again. Mr. Bieber is alleged to have threatened his neighbor and thrown eggs at the neighbor's house. These eggs are great! This resulted in 11 squad cars full of police coming to Mr. Bieber's house to search it for evidence of felony egging. If he's charged in that case, that would be another charge of assault. Once again, that's up to another six months. If any of the eggs actually hit his neighbor, he could be charged with battery. Battery is the unlawful use of force or violence against the person of another. Possible sentence for battery, depending on the level of injury, is from six months to a year. And finally, he could be charged with felony vandalism for the damage his eggs caused. If they cause more than $400 worth of damage, it's a felony with a possible one year in the big house. Now remember, Mr. Bieber has not been charged with most of these crimes, and it's unknown if he ever will be, or if he will ever be convicted of any crime. Even if he is, it's unlikely he'll actually serve any jail time. However, if he were convicted of all these crimes and the court imposed a maximum sentence, he could serve up to three and a half years in jail. Not guilty, your honor. And just as an additional little worry for the Beebster, he is a Canadian citizen and potentially subject to deportation. And that is this week's Lawyer Flash. You can find us here each week at lawyerflash.net or youtube.com slash lawyerflash. Also, check out our Facebook page and like it, and mostly subscribe to this YouTube channel. I'm your host, John Deere. We'll see you next week on Lawyer Flash. I'm a believer. I'm a believer. I'm a believer. I'm a believer. I'm a believer.